So, a um, bit of a change in weather. The uh, winter rain has returned for a day or so. Uh, some cooler weather for the next few days. Getting a good douse of rain, almost an inch so far this morning. A little more to come. So I think the water element is a good reflection. Also, uh, the internal water element having been supplemented by our super wonderful hydrated oatmeal this morning <laughs> to add uh, fluidity to our bodies. So, the, you know, it's a very life-sustaining kind of a, uh, element, water is. Uh, and even when it feels cold and wet outside, uh, I think most of us here appreciate having a bit of extra water in anticipation of the very dry, crispy summer to come. So it's a bit uncomfortable physically, but uh, it's part of our external world, part of our internal world. The quality uh, that we contemplate in the four elements uh, of fluidity, uh, movement, motion, but also, uh, as it said, cohesiveness and this watery quality of, of cohesiveness, helping to hold it all together, particularly if you contemplate the body elements. Uh, it kind of sustains the connectivity uh, in this body, and, and it's worth just trying to experience that uh, cohesion, that pulling together, because that's also, I find, a, a nice metaphor for the pulling together that we're trying to do um, with, our, uh, with our minds, with our hearts, uh, as we kind of settle down and uh, draw inwards, uh, dampen the outgoing movement of, of mind, uh, and consolidate, uh, which we can do in our moments of, of quiet meditation, our times in the forest, um, so that we're not constantly drawn out into the external world, but with this sense of cohesiveness, pulling back together <clears throat> to the central quality of knowing, of awareness, the rest of the world still moves around us, but the reference point stays uh, collected, composed, uh, and at its fully developed uh, uh, aspect, uh, it, it uh, is unwavering, and that the awareness that stays centered, collected, composed, um, consolidated, uh, that that is... Um, experiencing the rest of the world as it comes through, as it comes through uh, the awareness. So the sights and sounds and tastes and sensations, and even the thoughts uh, can be seen as objects that are passing through awareness, but the reference point is always that knowing quality. That's the cohesive element uh, uh, of our mental experience. So a day like this is really good. It's, it kind of naturally uh, suggests that we pull in uh, and not be drawn out into the external world uh, of body and mind and to just uh, stay at that cool, calm, uh, cohesive center of the quality of knowing and let the rest just pass through. So leave that for this morning's reflection. <clears throat>